Automatic actions. Contents. 1. Overview. 2. Creating automatic actions. 3. Adding time frames to an automatic action. Overview. Complex automatic actions can be created in TCOM C4. Automatic actions are configured on the automatic actions panel. Automatic actions consist of triggers and actions that are executed when the trigger occurs. Triggers can be events in TCOM C4. See the events module for more information or time triggers. Multiple actions can be executed in sequence for each trigger. Multiple triggers and their actions can be combined in one automatic action. An automatic action can have a calendar assigned to it so it can only be triggered within specified time frames. An automatic action can have a holiday set configured so that its calendar can include holidays. See the holidays module for more information. Creating an automatic action. Navigate to the automatic actions panel. Click the add button to add a new automatic action. Enter a name and optional description for the automatic action. If required, set a holiday set for the automatic action. Click the event trigger button to add a new event based trigger. A new window opens with the complete list of events in TCOM C4. Select the event to trigger the automatic action, for example access denied, and click the OK button. An incomplete automatic action has been added, indicated by the red border. Depending on the type of event, add extra conditions to the event. For example, an access denied event can have an associated device such as a door or card reader. Now add an action to be executed when the trigger occurs. A new window opens with the complete list of actions in TCOM C4. Select an action, for example show on client computer, and click the OK button. Depending on the type of action, additional information may be required. For example, a show on client computer action requires a camera to show and an operator to show it too. Add more triggers and actions as required. The following example shows time-based triggers. Click the time trigger button to add a new time-based trigger. Set the time for the action to be triggered. Configure the action, for example unlock a door. Add more triggers and actions as required. The underlying script for the automatic action can be edited by clicking the edit button. Advanced users only. The automatic action can be enabled and disabled with the enable checkbox. Disabled automatic actions have a disabled icon. Adding time frames. Click the calendar tab to add time frames to the automatic action. Click the add button to add a time frame to the automatic actions calendar. Tick the days that the automatic action should be active. Select the start and end times that the automatic action should be active. Multiple time frames can be added together. Ticking HO for holidays will make the automatic action active on the holidays configured on the general settings tab. 